this is really the question that um, has me advocating um, what's uh, maybe a bit non-standard, which is that um, instead of trying to convert everything into SI units and then do that, which might be the default thing people tell you to do, and kind of telling you, okay, keep these unusual units that you are given. And then at the very end, convert atmosphere liter into joules. And the reason here is, uh, so I think everyone here knows that when you express work as the integral of PDV, then you know what graphically this means. Graphically this means area under the uh, pressure as a function of volume curve. Like everyone knows that, right? Yes. That doesn't sound like anything surprising. <laughs> At least it sounds familiar enough. <laughs> um, so, so when you um, when you look at this uh, figure, which looks like a nice semicircle, in the plot that you are given here, in the units that you are given here, then when it asks for network done by the gas, you have a very easy way to calculate how what that work done by gas over one cycle is. Over one cycle, the area, the work done by the gas will be area under the curve. And you do have to be a little bit careful, like if they reverse the direction, then uh, it would be area under the curve except the negative of that. So here, um, if you understood this uh, geometric interpretation of work done by expanding or contracting gas, then you have this uh, nice, uh, simple geometric understanding that, oh yeah, I just need to calculate area of that semicircle, which is pi r squared over two. And here, this r would be the radius here of one. So the work done by this gas over one cycle here would be pi over two. Now, if you plug in pi over two here, it'll tell you it's wrong because it's a pi over two in the units of atmosphere liter. So all I have to do now is convert that atmosphere liter into joules. So let me do that here. Pi over two atmosphere liter in joules. Uh, 159 joules, so in kilojoules, it should be 0 0.159. And so the way this question is presented um, in order to use this geometric understanding, you do, uh, until you get to the final answer, you do have to keep it in atmosphere and liters. Otherwise, um, you can't, because you know, if you can imagine if I change the scales here, it won't look like a semicircle anymore. It'll look like half of an ellipse. And that's more complicated formula. Um, okay, uh, so in the opposite direction, oh, um, <laughs> so here what you have to read carefully is by the gas and on the gas. And when they say on the gas, um, it's still the same number. Now, if they ask for by the gas, then I would put minus sign. I hope that's what the hint explains. Yeah, yeah, think through the wording carefully, yeah. Um, and you know, a lot of times if you um, put in an answer here and you get an answer that it says your answer is wrong, but you think everything's right, it's kind of worth trying out. Hey, did I just get the sign wrong? Um, and you know, and if it's on an assessment and you got the answer most right, except for the sign, that would be, depending on the context, it would be either a minor error or just one major conceptual error. It depends on if the sign was important or not. Or if it, like there were other evidences where you should have recognized that you had a sign error. 